hello everyone so welcome back to another video so today I'm going to show you how to add transitions into your um, recordings or live streams okay um, yeah most people edit some people edit their transition in but you really don't need to you can just do it live using like these scene transitions so normally the original one is fade so as you can see it just fades all right but if you want to add a custom transition what you want to do is you want to change this to stinger all right and then click on settings and then properties and then it will show this all right so i'm going to have this um transition pack um it isn't mine all right i just found it online but i'll put in the download link in the description i'll upload it to some download website and you can download it easily anyway so just click on it it is a zip file so you will need to unzip it okay all right so you've got all these make sure you read this because this is transition points okay so it's, it's all done in frame okay so i don't know choose whichever one you like so this is the one i use okay so you can open that in your thing and s you can just have a look at each one and see whether you like it um so like shutter um so like there's all different colors of each one okay you can see whether you like them and whatnot and what you want to do is you've got the transition points all right so each one of these is for each file each um video file is the exact same um but when um say you want to use one second um okay all right so let's say hyper arrow let's do um green say open that all right so this will automatically be under time milliseconds and you want to change this setting to frame all right then you want to have a look on here which one is it hyper arrow okay so you look at that and then transition point that's that frame so that's 60 so you'll change that to 60 all right and then you know preview transition and that's what it'll look like but say i had this at 44 no 45 it wouldn't actually play the whole thing oh wait oops let me just do it again all right okay 45 then if we like previewed it it will cut it half out wait one sec but yeah it doesn't like properly do it like very good it cuts out a bit of it you know but anyway so if that's how you add different transitions um, you just make sure it set its stinger and whatnot, and um, yeah, um, it should go for all of them. But if you want to add like, so with these you can also do it where you add stinger high transition, set it to stinger. So it'll go green. All right, um, sixty. No, frame. Okay, there we go, and then when we hide it all right it would do that then when we show it it wouldn't do anything because you need to add a show transition so if you want to add different um say i wanted to do like um let's say glitch kind of let's do dark blue and then set that to frame which one's this one 45 all right set that to 45 and then okay so when we hide it, it would look like this, but when we show it, it would look like that. You know, you can add different things for different sources if you understand what I mean. Anyway, thank you for watching. If you want to see episode five or six, I have no clue what it's going to be now. Um, it it will there'll be a card on the screen that says what it's going to do, what it's going to be. I don't even know if there's going to be another one. Um, if if there isn't another one, um, tell me if there's anything else you guys want to know, and I will make that into a video. And then, when I upload that video, I'll add the card on this video. Anyway, thank you for watching, and goodbye.